Well, hello, this is Joanne with Stuff to Discuss, and I am here to discuss the Golden Goose sneaker. Yes, I know, I know. It's a weird sneaker that is, I hope I'm saying the right sneaker. I can never pronounce things right. Get strong. Get strong. Uh, it's a weird sneaker that it's like distressed and it's like you are uh, worn it and it's why would you pay so much money for it it's a lot of money so we're going to talk about that today and i'm going to show you some dupes that you can also purchase along the way if you didn't want to pay that price but i want to thank the people that watch this channel thank you so much so much so much and also those that you are just joining thank you for just joining this channel to see what's going on and want to know about stuff uh, don't forget to like this channel comment below and thumbs up this video like it thumbs it up and also uh, ring the, the that bell for notification also check us out on stuff to discuss TV uh, for interviews and also Joe at Joanne's fashion uh, for the fashion that you know I try to give that you know I know about but anyway yeah, check it out so let's get started um, I shop at Savers and I know a lot of people go to Savers so I know people go don't tell don't tell but you know what I go to different types of Savers so it doesn't matter which one and it's not like they have a lot of them it's not like if you go to Nordstrom's or if you go to Neiman Market there's like a, a slither of these shoes but in a way it's good find and so I want to show you the find that I found at this thrift shop. Alright so here they are these are the Golden Goose uh, sneakers I think I'm saying it right. I want to see sneakers sneakers yeah sneakers and so, <laughs> and so this is uh, what I found and they are the GGDB and I think they call the DB deluxe is that what called I'm not for sure please you know comment below if you know the answer to what it really is it's got the stars on the side now this is this one wasn't so distressed and I guess you can get the ones that are really distressed which I think is kind of stupid but um, the ones that have uh, the distress is like really like I don't know got a lot of dirt look a looking dirt thing but in a way where it just looked like it's worn um, this wasn't as worn and here's the um, the what do you call it the tread that's at the bottom of it and also this is a leather uh out like real fine not fine leather but you know it's like it's got the upper leather they call it or whatever you want to call it and then the tongue is leather as, as well and i'll just go ahead and do a side shot of this and inside though this one says z h u o Casio. i don't even know how to pronounce that but i went on google and looked it up and it brought up these sneakers so I don't know if it's some type of brand if you know and you could tell me um, I don't know but one of the things came up and it said it was a dupe of this I don't know dupe of what of this brand maybe try to make the golden goose or sometimes brands you know collab with other brands so I'm just learning about this whole golden goose uh, sneaker so um but yeah so I it's got a little bit of distress on the side as well and also um, in the back it doesn't say golden goose but right here on this side it do do the GB whatever golden goose BD uh, is it BD or DB or whatever it goes uh, the superstar but I think this could be a dupe I'm not for sure but you tell me I it's it's, it's kind of crazy so anyway but I think they fit pretty well they're very light of course so I'm gonna show you the dupes that you can buy for a cheaper price okay so Steve Madden has, has come out and said by Steve it's called uh, these kind of golden goose that I thought was actually pretty cool they're called the fire the firebird the free bird and so here's the free bird and I saw this also I found this at savers as well and this has a bigger star and it's got double uh, stitching stars on it and the distress on it is a little bit it's still not as bad and it has like it says it's from um, F is FB which is uh, free bird uh, 927 so if you look this up these things run you like oh so like I said the the golden goose can run you like 500 bucks or a little bit less um, under five but I think that the more distressed golden goose super is a superstar I have to check that out again but they could run you up there and I think it's kind of you know ridiculous but 
if you like that look and trend there you go um, right here you can tell that this is um, got little like spots and the 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 what do you call it <laughs> the uh, shoelace is a totally different type of you know feel and then on the tongue here is also a leather thing but it says it it's FB 927 like it says here and it has some numbers and inside it says cute things like uh, you can't cage this bird so I thought it was cute I don't know if you could see it you can't cage this bird but yeah now this says Clark because someone took out the soul and basically put their own soul in so it must have been like a soul that was kind of hard for them to wear or hurting their feet because when I saw it I was kind of thrown off like well, does Clark make these uh, <laughs> these shoes? Because it's the Clark's Cloud Steppers, and then like that doesn't match. But anyway, I looked it up. Here's the sole. Uh, here's the the tread right here, and it's showing. It says Free Bird, and yeah. And I thought, see, it has the distress here, and it's dressing here, and it has just like the you know, like your golden goes in inside. You have uh, these. You know, it's like a, a leather fit or something like that. Or a suede thing going on here. So, yeah. So, I found these and I only paid, um, what did I pay? <laughs> oh, I paid nine bucks. I paid nine bucks for these. Uh, the other ones I paid, what, like ten bucks. So, if they was not the actual shoe or whatever, then... I didn't it's not a loss because I didn't spend 500 bucks for it but if you want something that's affordable go for the Steve Madden I do believe this is by Steve Madden but if it's not again check me at the comments so moving on shoes uh, to get you know I was seeing dupes a lot of dupes but to get something close to look like the Golden Goose shoes or sneakers okay I went to Marshall's and I saw these sneakers right here and I thought these were so cute because they gave you the shoe strings that has the little stars on it right and I thought that was so cute and basically this also is like a leather uh, upper leather I guess you want to say but it's not distress as you can see it's got the star here something and it's got like the gold in the back and this one is VH which is vintage Havana Vintage Havana is this one called, and on its, um, let me put one down, on its, <laughs> on its tongue is also a, it's a vintage Havana um, 1965 here, and on the tongue, it doesn't say that cute, but you know, it's a, it's a, yeah, it's a leather kind of thing here, and these things are so comfortable. Now, the other ones that I went to, they're comfortable too, but they're a little bit snug because I think... I don't know if Golden Goose is exact size. They go by your exact size. But I know that the, um, what is the Steve Madden one? The, the Free Bird or whatever you want to call it. Those fit a little bit wide and big. And this one fit snug as well. But um, it's very light. Just like if it was a Golden Goose, I suppose. So anyway, this has got, you know, very soft sole inside. Right here, you just got the regular kind of. Thing. there's no colors no not saying anything on it and yeah this is not distressed so I got this because this cost me what did it cost me it was on sale because Marshall's had a little sale thing going on so it cost me I don't know yeah it, this was was it 29 I think this was 29 and I think I got it for less than that but yeah I Marshall has some good dupes as well when it comes to uh, any of the trend brands that you after or you know they have the exact sometimes uh, but yeah I think this is such a cute shoe I wear a size like I said nine nine and a half I don't know if I mentioned that and then some eights sometimes eight eight and a half depending on the shoe depending if it's a heel depending if it's the boots so but yeah these are actually very comfortable so they gave me two types of shoelace they gave me um, if I want to change out the lace and you can do that with other shoes of course a white one and then these stars but I think these gray stars I like it because I feel edgy when well, I edgy but I feel like a little edgy cute edgy cute is that even a word yeah <laughs> it makes you feel more casual I think for me at least when it comes to putting on like uh, the pants you know like uh, blue jeans and 
you know, shorts and just a casual wear. Or you could do it with skirts or long skirts, whatever. So I do wear it with that. But these are cute, don't you think? These are awesome. These are very awesome, cute. So that is it for this video. It was kind of short. I know I'm usually long-winded. So I wanted to show you what I found at the thrift shop and uh, and also what I bought at Marshall. So go out there if you're looking for affordable uh, dupes. Just you get them. At, um, I think you get it on Amazon. You can get them. Um, you know, just at Marshalls, TJ Maxx. Um, sometimes uh, fa fashion, fa no, not fashion. Well, sorry, you could get them at H and M, and also um, Forever Twenty One. That's what I meant to say. So, but yeah. So, uh, if you like this channel, and I hope this was informative, because I'm all about that. Uh, just um, make sure that you thumbs up this video, like it, and again, like I said, comment below. And uh, yeah, that's it. So, see you in the next video, and uh, bye.